do you think that it's likely that we will merge somehow or another with this sort of technology and it'll augment what we are now? Or do you think it will s replace us? Well, that's the scenario. The, 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 the merge scenario with AI is the one that seems like probably the best. Like For if, us. Yes. Like if you, if you can't beat it, join it. <laughs> that's... <laughs> Yeah. You know, um, so from a long-term existential standpoint, that's like the purpose of Neuralink is to create a high bandwidth interface to the brain such that we can be symbiotic with AI because we have a bandwidth problem. You just can't communicate through your fingers. It's too slow. So instead of replacing us, it will radically change our capabilities. Yes, it will, it will enable anyone who wants to have superhuman cognition. Anyone who wants. This is not a matter of earning power because your earning power would be vastly greater after you do it. So it's just like anyone who wants can just do it in theory. That's the theory. And, and if that's the case, then, and let's say billions of people do it, then the outcome for humanity will be the sum of of human will, the sum of billions of people's desire for the future. And but that, that billions could be a, of people with enhanced cognitive ability, radically yes. enhanced. Yes.